My name is Michael Dessen. I'm a faculty member here at the University of California, Irvine in the Claire Trevor School of the Arts, and I'm in the music department. I'm here this week because we have a one-week, six-day camp for the kids where we're connecting a group of high school students here from Santa Ana High School with a group of high school age students in Manizales, Colombia, where it's a joint class run telematically using audio and video networking to connect the classrooms in the two places. Really the idea was to have a course where we could introduce them to basic concepts in electronic music as well as the idea of how to collaborate telematically, how to collaborate with people who are in other places. It requires some different skill sets and in particular we wanted them to experience both collaborative work that was sort of out of time things like editing sound collages and editing compositions together, but also experience what we experience when we do telematic music making with these new tools we're using, which is the ability to play music together with people who were located somewhere else. Hi, my name is Isaiah Benitez. Uh, I am 17 and I just graduated from Santa Ana High School. So hi, my name is Wendy Millan. I'm, I'm 15 years old and I'm from Santa Ana High School. Hi, my name is Cristobal Gallardo. I am 15 and I am in Santa Ana High School. Um, what I enjoyed from this was uh, the program, the soundtrack. That it was fun to like collaborate with the people from Colombia. And um, it was just fun to interact well for like a few minutes with them. Uh, I like the conduction because I've always wanted to be a conductor and the conduction was one way to get me uh, conducting even though it wasn't formal conducting. Uh, my favorite part was the editing because I was able to put in many different ideas. It's, it's a way for me to let out what I have in mind. Let's come back in. We had a few uh, different guests and instructors giving presentations on different kinds of contemporary music. So the kids are also interested in bringing their own ideas and we've, we've tried to have a good balance between letting them do things that they're interested in doing. So we're playing telematically a pop song by a band called DNC that I'd never heard of that they brought up yesterday. One of the things that has been most exciting is seeing them learn to play together in this telematic environment because it requires an expanded set of skills. You have to learn to listen across that distance and even when we get good quality sound it still requires a certain kind of attention uh, listening to people in that other space and finding that connection through sound so it's been wonderful to work on that with them. Me llamo Diego y toco sax, tengo 13 años. Bueno, he aprendido una cosa muy chida, a improvisar con gente que no está aquí, bueno, o sea, está en Estados Unidos y eso está muy cool. We've been working a little bit with the kids on improvisation and many of them have played written music on their instruments for years but they don't have much experience with improvisation so we've been working both improvising within forms like songs but also improvising in a more open freeway with sounds and conduction was one of the ways that we got them doing that, having conductors give them hand signals to guide a group to build certain kinds of textures. And that was really a fun uh, workshop that we did with Stephanie Richards here and Juan David Rubio in Colombia. So it helps get them out of their shell a little bit with improvisation. Many times they're timid about improvising at first, but when you have someone guiding them with these hand signals, it gets them to come out and play a little more. So that was really, really exciting. Uh, from two of the instructors in Colombia who work a lot with doing soundscape work there to preserve and explore and document villages and areas of, of the natural environment that are under danger of, of going extinct or, or changing rapidly due to industrialization. They give a wonderful presentation about what soundscapes are and what it means to capture the sounds or become more attuned to the sounds of your environment and we had the kids record some sounds from their areas and their building soundscapes that, that sort of express through sound uh, their sense of place. My name is Juanita Valencia, I have 14 years and I belong to Cuba Tour. Well, this week I have learned a lot of things. I have learned that music is not only 
estar en una partitura, sino que también te puedes salir de la partitura y hacer muchas cosas con tu instrumento. Hay que investigar el instrumento y sacarle provecho ahí. También he aprendido mucho sobre los paisajes sonoros, me gusta mucho. Because the idea of cultural exchange is really important here. The kids are slowly getting to know each other and experiencing a little bit through music and through sound the different worlds that they live in and are growing up in in Manizales, Colombia, and here in Santa Ana in California. We're really excited by this first week. It's been a really wonderful week to experiment with, with what's possible when you join classrooms from different locations, different cultures uh, for a week-long experience together. Aprendí sobre la improvisación, eh, a usar soundtrack, eh, a crear pistas y digamos es muy distinto a lo que nosotros hacemos en un ensayo de orquesta o en ensayos pues generales en batuta eh, porque no tenemos una partitura ni tenemos a alguien que nos esté dirigiendo todo el tiempo sino que es como más libre y es como más de creación.